alegro que van a escuchar esta clase. Hello, how are you? I'm very happy that you're going to be present in this class. So I'm putting together a little video so you can prepare for your Chilean adventure. And you're going to need to know some basic Spanish to get around. And I'm going to enforce it. So let's start with some really basic greetings. Hola. You know that one. Hola. You can also say saludos, greetings. You say, how are you? Como estas? Como estas? Or you can say, how's it going? Como le va? Como le va? To answer, you can say, muy bien. Bien. Más o menos. Mal. You can also say, enojado. You can say, triste. You can say, alegre. So, you gotta practice your greetings. If I say, como estas? You gotta be able to answer me. So, you're gonna also need to know, where's the bathroom? El baño. Donde esta el baño? Or, if you really need to go and you can't remember all that, <laughs> el baño, el baño. And you're gonna get to the bathroom. No problem. So I thought what you really need to know is when you're hungry. Because I'm going to be guiding you around most of the time, but there are going to be waiters coming up to you and say, hey, what do you want to eat? So first you need to know, tengo hambre. Tengo hambre. I'm hungry. And if I want to ask you or someone else wants to ask you if you're hungry, they would say, tienes hambre? Tú? Tienes hambre? You say, sí, tengo hambre, o oh, tengo mucho hambre. And when we are out to eat in a restaurant, you just say easily, yo quiero, I want, yo quiero pizza, for example. So I'm going to give you some basic uh, foods here that just what I had in the house, really. And then as we go to some restaurants, you're going to know a little bit more, a little bit more of the, the dishes that we're going to uh, eat. So I'm going to go, uh, let's go with the fruits first. Here we go. Piña. 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 Sandia. 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 Manzana, manzana, manzana. Limón, limón, limón. Now, if you don't learn anything else in all of your Chilean adventure, you gotta learn what this is. Black gold. Palta, palta, palta. The tongue hits the top of the mouth. Palta. In other countries, they call it aguacate, but here in this part of South America, they call it palta. All right, let's go with the vegetables. Papa. 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 Tomate. Fruta puede ser. Verdura puede ser. Fruta is fruit. Verdura is vegetable. Tomate. Acelga. It's very common here. This is chard, Swiss chard. Acelga. Acelga. Lechuga. Lechuga. I cut it up for my salad. Ensalada. Ensalada. Um, so it's kind of fine. Zanahoria. Zanahoria. Con Z. Con Z. Zanahoria. All right, let's go with some grains here. We got arroz, arroz, arroz. Porotos, porotos. Sarah, you might know that these are frijoles in other countries, but in Chile, they are porotos, porotos. Here we have avena, avena. Avena. I don't have any bread in the house. Pan. 
Pint is bread. Let's go with seeds. Semilla. Semillas. Semillas. Semilla de calabaza. Pumpkin seed. Semillas. And nuez. 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 Here we have mani, which is technically a legume. Mani. Okay, other foods. Galleta. Galleta. Galleta is both a cracker and a cookie. So you can say galleta salada, salty cracker, or, or cracker. Or you can say galleta dulce, or cookie. Galleta de arroz. Galleta de arroz. Rice cracker. Miel. Miel. Honey. Miel. Mermelada. Mermelada, like marmalade, mermelada. So we learn tomate, and here we have salsa de tomate, salsa de tomate. Other items. Te, te verde, green tea. Café, café. This is actually wheat coffee, café. Mantequilla, mantequilla, mantequilla. All right, and for the last stop on this episode, we're going to learn some basic needs at the table. So we have plato, plato, which is a plate and also a dish. So you read on the menu, plato, plato del dia, today's dish, plato. Casa, casa. I don't have any actual glasses. Those are vasos, which is different. Vasos. Tenedor. Cuchara. Cuchillo. Tenedor. Cuchara. Cuchillo. Tenedor. Cuchara. Cuchillo. Sal. Sal, sal, and aceite, 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 aceite. This is aceite de oliva, aceite de oliva, or olive oil. So this concludes the first lesson, Spanish lesson, from... Your loving son and brother, Will. Hope you've enjoyed it. Hope you learned these words and more to come.